Welcome to Channel 4, Maydac's own cable television outlet. By license authority of the Canadian Radio Television Commission, Hastings Cablevision Limited is proud to present the local program to follow. Access to this channel is free and open to all, providing that the material meets the standards of good taste that our viewers are entitled to. We invite you to share your ideas, your talent, experiences or events for all of the community to enjoy. Any opinions expressed or implied are not necessarily those of Hastings Cablevision Limited or its volunteer operating staff. Saturday in El Dorado began cloudy. It was a dark morning. It was a cold morning, but it was not a dreary morning. There were more than 25 entries at the starting gate. And if you're going to bet any money, just put it on the lady from West Germany, number 17 in red. Each dog team driver is wearing a number. The first team off is given number one, the next number two, and so on. They are starting exactly one minute apart. With that in mind, one can easily determine how a team is doing by its relative position among the other drivers at any given point. Number one is Gloria McEwen. Don McEwen, former champion, you've won this race. <laughs> And you placed second in several times, haven't you done? No, the Marmor race, we had a good deal of luck in some of the races, yeah. You have, 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 you, have, you, have you got someone close to you running today? Well, Tim, my son, is running our main team, and uh, Gloria is running a team, and also Dennis Parks is running a team. Gloria is your... Gloria, my daughter, yeah. Tim, my son, and Dennis Parks is a neighbor. Good. So, um... Tell me something about how how did El Dorado get the the um, races here? Was this a last minute thing? This was a last minute. It it all happened since uh, Wednesday night of this week uh, when officially the Marmor race had to be cancelled. Uh, we simply just got a hold of the mushers and decided we want to have a race and. Uh, the community got behind us and we were able to raise a $2,000 person in 48 hours. <laughs> you did. Yeah. 
this, this. Go down. Hey. Could, Sorry. Could this be a permanent? Uh, it's second I get it in focus. Could this be a, um, an annual occasion for Alvarado to have a race like this? Well, as far as mushers are concerned, we don't have enough races. You don't have enough. We racers? need every musher that trains dogs needs seven race, races a year. Right now, to try and get seven races, we travel into northern Quebec and down into the uh, Pennsylvania, New York areas and try to get these races. And we'd like to have more in Ontario. And I there, think there is a possibility. Oh, as far as the mushers are concerned, yes. As far as the community is concerned, they just raised two thousand dollars in forty-eight hours. I think right? it's a possibility. Yes. <laughs> Great. Yeah. Reverend Don McEwen. You won the Marmor race quite handily. I don't remember the year, but I believe it was when the couple were married. How important is the Marmor race? The Marmor Cup is the race you're speaking of, I guess. Yes. Is that one of the chief ones in Canada? Long distance in Ontario, yes. It's a pretty, a very, very important race. And uh, uh, we're not even crossing our minds that it might not exist next year. We're expecting it to exist next year. Thanks a lot, man. Thank you. Everything's stopping in there. Oh, he's true, baby. Okay. He's got his dog's dead. He's got one dog, then two dogs, and one dog, then two dogs. Braun Mitchell, West Germany, number 17. That's the West Germany lady. I really Germany. Doug Willett, all the way from Utah. That guy? He's going to unleash some hope. Knock the difference in climate, too. Knock the difference in climate between here and there, I bet you.
She's the second one. Yeah. Yep. She's number. She's the second. Come on, Al. Let's see a kick there a little harder. Hey. Let's see a kick there a little harder. You go home. I don't have any more energy left. <laughs> I think that winner's gonna. Alright. Go, Al. The winners are going in pretty good, huh? Yeah. Gloria McEwen. Yeah, that's Gloria. Come on, Gloria! Come on, come on, come on! Come on! Come on, guys! Look at the running sideways. And I hunted back up north for your, with your dad. Up Beaver Creek for quite a few years after I came back from over. That's right. Well, they're kind of slowing down a little bit, too.
Stay right here, Crystal. 